Welcome back everyone. In this video, I will discuss how to display the selected state, city and area in the home view. Now in the state controller, in the save selected state method earlier, I have saved the state ID only. Now I am saving the state name as well to the gate storage. Similarly, in the city controller with the city ID, I am saving the city name. And in area controller with the area ID and pin code, I am saving the area name. Now let me move to home view. In the home view, in the scaffold body, I have taken a list view and as a first children, I have called a method build search. And why I have created this method? This method is actually creating this search widget. Okay. Let me show you what I have done in the build search method here. I have returned a gesture detector in the on tab. I will move to the search page that I will implement later on. And as a child, I have taken a container with this margin and padding. Then I have used a decoration in the child. I have taken this raw widget, row widget. And here I have taken an icon. As you can see here, this icon search icon is displayed here. And there is a text which is displaying search products, brand and more. Okay. And after that, I have used a sized box having the height as 2 then I am using I am calling this particular method to display this particular portion that is state city and area let me show you what I have done here in this particular method again I have returned a gesture detector and in the on tab I am calling a function move to state okay actually whenever I will click here then I should move to the state view from where I can select the state then city and then area and to do that I have called this move to state function which I have created inside the home controller that I will show you. Then in the child I have taken a container with this padding then in the color I have checked if it is in the dark mode then it will display the yellow color with opacity 0.2 and if it is in the light mode then it will display deep purple ascent color but with opacity 0.2 as you can see here this container is having this deep purple ascent background but with certain opacity. After that, this widget is I have taken. Then in the icon, I have taken this location city. Here also, I have checked the color and accordingly, it will change with dark and light mode. Then in the expanded widget, I have taken a column and in this text, I am displaying the state, city and area. And from where I am getting these values, these values I am getting from the home controller. As you can see here, I have created the instance of gate storage. I have created these three variables. And I am storing the state name, city name and area name from get storage to these variables. And whatever value is stored in these variables that I have displayed to this particular text widget. And I have given some styles to the text widget. Then I have used the icon that is edit. And accordingly I have changed its color. Correct. And here as you can see whenever I will click here then it should move to the state view and for that I have created a function move to state what it is doing it is calling get dot to named roots dot state this means whenever I will click here it should move to the state as you can see West Bengal is selected by default now let me click here running as a city is displayed if I click here then the area is displayed and let me click here and you can see the corresponding value is displayed here and if I change it to dark mode then you can see accordingly this color has been changed. This is how I have displayed the state, city and area to the home view. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you so much for watching.